A Savage War of Peace, Algeria, 1954-1962, A Literary Analysis Alastair Horn's A Savage War of Peace, Algeria, 1954-1962, provides a comprehensive and vivid account of one of the most tumultuous and complex conflicts of the 20th century. In this literary analysis, we will explore the themes, narrative techniques, and historical context within Horn's work. Horn's central theme is the Algerian War of Independence, a brutal and protracted struggle between the National Liberation Front, FLN, seeking to free Algeria from French colonial rule, and the French government determined to retain its colony. Horn weaves a compelling narrative that delves into the intricate web of political, social, and cultural forces that drove this conflict. One of the book's most striking features is its commitment to historical accuracy. Horn's meticulous research and extensive use of primary sources, including interviews with key figures, lend the narrative an authoritative and credible tone. He avoids oversimplification, presenting a nuanced account that acknowledges the complexities and ambiguities of the war. This historical accuracy is essential for a deeper understanding of the conflict and its consequences. Horn skillfully portrays the human dimension of the war. He introduces readers to a diverse cast of characters, from FLN leaders like Ahmed Ben Bella to French military officers like Jacques Massou. Through their personal stories and experiences, Horn humanizes the conflict, making it relatable to readers. This technique not only engages the audience but also underscores the profound impact of the war on individuals and communities. One of the book's most compelling sub-themes is the moral dilemma faced by the French government and military. Horn explores the ethical quandaries surrounding torture and repression employed by the French to combat the FLN. He does not shy away from depicting the brutality of these methods, forcing readers to confront uncomfortable truths. By doing so, he invites readers to grapple with the broader question of the ethics of counterinsurgency warfare, a theme still relevant today. Horn also highlights the role of nationalism in shaping the conflict. He underscores how the Algerian desire for independence was fueled by a powerful sense of national identity and self-determination. On the French side, he portrays the deep-seated belief in the importance of maintaining Algeria as part of French territory. This clash of nationalisms lies at the heart of the war, and Horn's exploration of it offers valuable insights into the dynamics of colonialism and decolonization. In addition to exploring the political and military aspects of the conflict, Horn delves into its social and cultural dimensions. He examines the impact of the war on the lives of ordinary Algerians and French settlers, as well as the broader implications for France's post-colonial identity. This multifaceted approach enhances the reader's understanding of the war's far-reaching consequences. Horn's narrative style is characterized by its clarity and coherence. He expertly navigates the complex web of events, personalities, and ideologies, providing readers with a chronological and thematic framework that facilitates comprehension. His writing is engaging, making it accessible to both scholars and general readers alike. The author also employs foreshadowing and retrospection to create a sense of anticipation and reflection. He opens the book with a scene from the Battle of Algiers in 1957, an intense urban conflict, before delving into the historical background. This technique piques the reader's interest and sets the stage for the unfolding narrative. Similarly, Horn frequently returns to the Battle of Algiers throughout the book, using it as a focal point for analysis and reflection. Horn's work is firmly situated within its historical context. He provides a thorough overview of the historical events leading up to the war, 
including the colonial history of Algeria and the rise of nationalist movements. This contextualization is crucial for readers unfamiliar with the intricacies of Algerian history, ensuring that they can fully grasp the significance of the conflict. In conclusion, Alastair Horn's A Savage War of Peace, Algeria, 1954-1962, is a masterful literary work that offers a profound and multifaceted exploration of the Algerian War of Independence. Through meticulous research, a commitment to historical accuracy, and engaging narrative techniques, Horn provides readers with a deeper understanding of the themes, complexities, and human dimensions of this savage and transformative conflict. His work is a testament to the enduring relevance of history as a means of understanding the present and shaping the future.